The first thing I remember about it was being in the balcony and looking down at people dancing on a Saturday night to a live band. Marsha Allen turned seven years old when the Cottage Grove Armory opened its doors in 1931. I remember it being an auspicious looking building. Huge, huge inside. The biggest inside space we had. Covered that in 1931 when the building was constructed that the citizens of Cottage Grove passed a bond measure and put in $15,000 to the purchase or to the construction of the armory. That's nearly a quarter of the cost of the 33,000 square foot building. The Great Depression didn't stop the project. People understood better times were on the horizon and they needed to invest in the future. In 2009, the armory was decommissioned. Retired Operations First Sergeant Burt Wheeler spent a lot of time here in the 60s, 70s, and 80s. Uh, when it was decommissioned, I had kind of a heavy heart, to tell you the truth, you know, because I thought it was going to be like uh, some of the other armories tore down. The building will not be torn down. The city of Cottage Grove paid $395,000 for the armory, a lot less than the asking price of $760,000. Materials for everything in this building except for the floor tile and the restrooms came from around Cottage Grove. The dream is to make this a gem of what it used to be in the community. I mean, the community came together in 1931 and, and saw the need for a space like this for events and activities, and we still have that need. The community needs $3.2 million to complete the restoration. Much of that will come from grants. The restoration includes a commercial kitchen, movie theater, climate control, archival storage, classrooms, meeting space, and much more. This is more than a building. It's about tradition, celebrations, and history. During the war, we said goodbye to a lot of people here in Cottage Grove. There were either husbands or fathers or uncles or brothers or nephews. It's about first dates, dances, and graduations. It's about preserving who you are as a community by saving bits and pieces of your past. Isn't that what Cottage Grove is all about? Saving its past and in doing so, creating its future. Oh, this is, this is a gem. Uh, gold mine is a big thing to say in Cottage Grove because of our mining heritage, and this is just another piece of that heritage. <laughs>